Okay, so this is part two of the thoracic organs. This is lab three. And we're going to look at uh, the nerves now. So if we look right down here near the brachiocephalic and the subclavian on the left side, we see a couple of nerves. There's one nerve here and there's one nerve here. And really, when the cat was first dissected, these two nerves were right next to each other. So they have different names. Um, we have to decide what they are. First of all, we notice that this one's just a little bit bigger diameter. This is the vagus. And this one that's a smaller diameter is the phrenic. But that's not the best way to tell. Best way to tell is to look right up in the neck. We see right next to the common carotid artery, there's a nerve. This is the vagosympathetic trunk. If we pull the vagosympathetic trunk, the vagus moves. And if we go back down here, we've made a little loop in the vagosympathetic trunk. If we go down here and we pull on the vagus, watch that loop move. See it go away? That's an old trick. You can do this at parties. Okay, so we make that little, tr <laughs> little loop there. And then if we grab the phrenic and I pull the phrenic, you see how the vagosympathetic trunk doesn't move. Okay? And that's because it doesn't attach to it. Okay. If we look right here between the two H here, we can see a blue vessel coming obliquely across the uh, cranial end of the heart. comes from the right ventricle, and this is the pulmonary trunk. I'm going to move the pericardium out of the way. If we do that, we can see that there is a nerve running right through here, and that's that phrenic that we saw before. And we can see if I roll them just a little bit, that phrenic nerve comes right down here to the diaphragm. There's the phrenic nerve here. We have a tubular organ right here, that's the esophagus, and then just dorsal to that is a pink organ, and that is the aorta. And then the last thing over here, running right along the vertebral border, is a piece of dental floss, and that is the sympathetic, sympathetic trunk. We can also see those branches off the aorta going into the subcostal groove over here. Okay, so this is the diaphragm. Caudal vena cava is over here. Fortunately, I was reminded that we didn't talk about that. Caudal vena cava comes through the diaphragm right here, and you can see there's a nerve running on its surface, and that is the right phrenic. Okay? The right phrenic nerve on the caudal vena cava, diaphragm. Oh, one more. We got to just show you the trachea. The trachea is up here. You can see the trachea coming down, and it's got cartilaginous rings in it. And then we should probably take a look at the lung. So do we get the lung out? Did the lung come out yeah, of the bag? Yeah, where's the lung that was in it? Was in um, the bag. It's in the bag. Yeah. It's okay, in the bag. we'll do the